Hey, welcome back. I'm Jay and this is Unboxing Treasures. Um, today we have a few different boxes. Let's get started with the first box. This is, I believe, the Marvel Collector Core box, which should be the X-Men this month. Yes, X-Men. So put that to the side. And I have not seen any of these opened yet, so it will be a surprise to me what's in here. Hopefully it will be a surprise to some of you all as well. Alright, so looks pen. Okay, it looks like it's a uh, Professor Xavier with his, I can't think of the name of it right now, but the little attachment that he hooks to his head to be able to read everybody's minds all over the world or however that goes. All right. And it looks like the t-shirt's next. Oh, I'm liking the colors on it already. What do we have here? Oh, that's pretty cool. If you're an X-Men fan, you'll like that. All right, very cool. Cyclops, Wolverine, Professor X. All right. Okay, what's next? We have... Oh, that just tells you what's in there. I don't want to see that. What we got? Oh, very cool Nightcrawler sticker. Uh, looks like we have the two pops left. They're in there right next to each other pretty good, so don't want to damage them. Give them a little help getting out. Alright, so the first one is... Alright, this is Logan. Well, can't go wrong with a Logan or a Wolverine pop. And that's very neat. See his wooden claws before we got the adamantium skeleton. So that's a neat one. I bet this one will will do pretty well as far as collectability. People love Wolverine Logan and this is a very neat one. I like this side, the side picture you can see really good. All right, so what's the next pop? It's going to be... It's going to be... Oh, Mystique. Oh, that's very cool. Mystique. Morphing into like Wolverine. That's very neat. So this is a good box this month. They have some interesting, interesting characters. The Logan's my favorite just because it, it just looks so cool. Alright, but that is the Marvel Collector Core box for this month. And I would say that is a good hit. And next month we have... Marvel Zombies. Very cool, very cool. I enjoy that box a lot. Alright, so... Alright. Next we have... What looks to be... A Funko Pickup. So... Right before San Diego Comic-Con, I went in there and ordered a couple pops just because I wanted to be familiar with the process since it changed. I hadn't ordered anything from them since they had the website redesigned, so I wanted to get logged in, sign up, and I picked up a couple pops to see how the process went. And it went fine up until later that night in San Diego Comic-Con. So, let's see. I think, if I remember correctly, I ordered just two common pops from there. I had ordered this one recently, the same one from them, not too long ago, but I, I got it damaged. So this one's a lot better condition. Sp OG Spider-Man. Yeah. yeah, much more happier with the condition on this one. Okay. 
And the next one that I got was the OG Deadpool. I have a metallic Deadpool that's going for sale this weekend, but I just wanted the OG regular. And this one has some creasing on the back. Funko will probably say that is acceptable creasing, but for me it's not, so this will be going for sale also. Or it might be in a mystery box. Who knows? I've got some big news with mystery box announcements coming before too long. All right, we got two more packages today. We got this one is from GameStop. This is actually not a mystery box. I don't remember what's in here. Let's find out together. Okay, so I, I know what it is. I really, I like pens, and I really like these Funko pens. I came, I was pretty late to the game seeing them, but I really like them. I like them probably just as much as the fig pens. These are a little bit bigger, and they have a, a more, a, they're on unique little display, but I really like these. Leave me a comment, let me know what do you think about the Funko pens. Do you like them? How do you compare them to the uh, um, fig pens? So I just got a random one from each from these lines, the DC, Star Wars, and Marvel line. So I didn't know which one I was going to get because I don't have any of them yet. So my random Star Wars pen, Darth Vader. I don't know if you'll be able to see him because of the colors. He's a little black. Yeah, but I really like these. And I imagine that somebody's going to have pop protectors for them pretty soon if they are all this standard box size. All right, and our last one is, who did we get? Oh, we got Loki from Marvel. That's really neat. I love these pens. They're so cool. So cool. All right, so what do we have next today? All right. This one is from Spastic Collectibles. And we'll wind up this evening's video. So, oh, this is going to remain in the box for a while, probably until October, because 13 Day Spooky Countdown. Let's see on the back. Let's see some of those characters. So, very cool advent calendar. The horror edition, as you can see, has Annabelle Comes Home, It. Little Shop of Horrors, The Shining, The Nun, Beetlejuice, The Exorcist, A Nightmare on Elm Street, Friday the 13th, and The Lost Boys are the franchises that are included in this calendar. So, very cool. And of course, we got our Spastic Collectibles sticker. So, very cool. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out with me and watching another video. If you're not already, please hit the subscriber button. Also, if you'd like to be informed of future videos, hit the notification bell, and please hit that thumbs up. So that's everything for today's video. Have a good day.